Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Battle Brothers. So we are escorting a caravan to Azenstadt, which is fairly nearby. Um, I just didn't want to finish it because we might have run into another battle, and the last episode was already getting kind of long. Um, anyways, hopefully the rest of the trip should be fairly uneventful. We've managed to keep all the caravans alive, which is good. Oh! Uh, hmm. Ah, I think we're already reasonably close to getting all of the settlements visited, so why don't we pick up that one? Oh! We found a dog! Yes, take it in. We need a mascot. You gain battle brother at the dog. Sweet, we should- oh, yeah. I'm getting attacked by goblins. Um, I don't even have a chance to equip our, uh, dog. Or do anything like that. Okay. Also, I think we're still beat up from the last fight. Uh, not too badly. Our armor could use some work. And a lot of our archers are carrying their melee weapons. Also, Harold still doesn't have a shield, because I keep forgetting to do that. Uh, on the upside, they are coming to us. Okay. Um, we can't range on their archers, which is a problem, because those guys are going to be poisoning us the whole fight. But whatever. Um, so the guy who's closest. Don't miss. Uh, geez, this is even worth swapping to the bow. Swapping weapons costs 4 AP, so he's not going to be able to shoot. We may as well... The archers who have their melee weapons out... Well, the ones who... I guess Guntram is the only one who's really keeping his melee weapon, because he's it's not worth stream, ah, changing him to his ranged weapon. He's not going to get to do anything anyways. Uh, Caravan hands do nothing. Magnus with his flail. You're going to be a good asset here. But there's nothing happening this turn, so you guys may as well wait. Our spear guys can get their spears up, though. Alright, Erwin. Uh, who do you have a good hit chance on? Missed. Okay, boulder, spear, there you go. Harold, uh, you're on the high ground, which is good, but you don't have a shield and your armor's kind of shredded, which is bad. Um, but I don't want to give up the high ground, so you're just going to wait up there. Same for all our axe guys. Egon does not have a reach weapon and does have a hunting bow, so he's actually better off swapping. And he can, I guess, just fire... Nope, missed. Uh, do I want to move Henrik up to get the first swing in on this guy? Or do I want to trust in our spear wall? It's currently... The spear wall is covering most of our line. I think we'll trust in our spear wall. Alright, Gaseller. You are a good shot. And you also have your bow out. There we go. We're only hitting a guy. Alright, Fritz. Oh, right. Fritz has no fatigue because he's just super beat up. Okay. And now all their archers get to... Okay, well at least they have to move into range to fire at us. So I know what our archers are going to be doing with their time. Cavern hands continue to do nothing. Alright, goblins, let's see what you got. Okay, they're moving up and playing defense. Ow. Poor Fritz. Okay, they netted Einar, which is rude. They killed Fritz. Man, this caravan escort has been a rough one. Go. Get that guy a good hit. And I guess that's your turn. Uh, Magnus, if you just want to collapse in on these guys. There you go. Okay, they're trying to hit Harold. The archers are not doing a whole lot, which is good, because the poison is really, really nasty to get hit by. Uh, yeah, I guess we may as well just collapse in on these guys, because they've kind of positioned themselves in a way that we can just encircle them. hit chance. You know what? Just break this guy's. I want to get him out of there. So break his shield and then have our other, uh, have Henrik just smack him. All right. You can actually hit this guy, Herbert, or we could plink away at their archers a little bit. Is there anyone I can hit who's not suffering a penalty? That guy is it. Hmm. Yeah. So we'll just try and get him out of there. Egon, take a shot at... Hmm, you also don't have that many good targets. Alright, fire at this guy. Missed. Erwin. There we go. Hit from the crossbow there. Have to break this net. Ah, oh, jeez, that's building up so much fatigue. Walder. Pile in. Nope, missed. Henrik. Get rid of that shield. Gesseller. Missed. Okay. Ha! 
<laughs> ah, yeah, there's that poison. All right, we need to back Harold out before anything bad happens to him here. I don't think the poison does damage, but it does... Re oh, he's dead. Okay. Well, never mind. God, this has been a rough caravan escort. This is our, what, third fight? Escorting this one caravan? And they've all been in, like... It's not been that long a trip, either. Okay, um, you're gonna wait, because we're gonna get a chance to break that dude's shield. Okay, that guy's throwing bolas at me, which I really don't appreciate. Uh, Magnus can actually just flail over this dude's head. And, wow. It's a very terrible hit chance, actually. It's impressive, because Magnus' uh, weapon skill is quite good. Or melee skill. Alright. Shield for me. Thank you. Egon, you can take a shot at... 16, 31. Missed. Okay. Erwin... There we go. Okay, Baldur, see if you can just get rid of that guy for me. Oh, Baldur got a double kill. All right, Henrik. Missed. Okay, seller. Okay, that guy's running. There we go. All right, Einar. Still can't get out of that net. Someone's going to have to help him. Whatever, we'll worry about that when the fight's over. Einar is not a, you know, major damage dealer or anything. Not that anyone's really a major damage dealer, because no one can hit anything right now. Oof, those... I'm really hoping the ambushers just kind of run away once we kill all the melee guys, because dealing with ambushers is such a pain. Ow. Rude. I didn't say you could leave. Apparently you can, though, because no one can hit you. Oh, we broke his fingers, too. Alright, you need to wait, because we need to move other people up so that you can move. Uh, we may as well take some of these shots at their archers. Wow, we actually hit that 5% hit chance. Not bad. Missed. Okay, you are... Oh, you're on range of this guy. Yeah, unfortunately, goblins, I think, just get really good, like, uh, melee defense base, just from, like, dodging and things, which makes them kind of a pain to fight. And you don't tend to get that much good stuff from fighting them, so... This is really, like, not a great situation for us. Oh, now we can hit them. There we go. Yeah, we're just piling on this last guy. We'll kill him, and hopefully our archers can hit some of these guys. Alright, can you break out this net? Oh my god. Okay, that guy's trying to run away. He's not getting very far. The skirmishers are doing something. I don't know what, though. Okay, that's his turn. Uh, the skirmishers are... or ambushers, I mean aren't shooting at me. They seem to be backing away, which is good. Missed. Okay, let's try and chase some of these guys down. Hello, friends. Uh, how far can you move and still shoot? There. Missed, okay. Uh, why don't you go support Magnus up there? Yeah, if you move around this way, you'll still be attacking this guy when he tries to run. Egon, can't shoot at anybody. Let's just take this high ground up here. Erwin, same deal. We're just going to get up on the high ground. Let's see if we can rain some arrows down on them. There we go. Okay, that guy's dead. So now we can focus on chasing down the ambushers. Einar still cannot break free of his net. He's just stuck there. All right, let's go this way. Try and get all our archers up on the high ground. What are the ambushers doing? Okay, they're stopping to shoot at me. They're going to fight this one out. Okay, they're all missing, which is fine by me. Okay, let's move Put him up to there, and then he can wait, because Magnus is going to move up a step. Ah, shoot, got poisoned. Ah, I hate fighting goblins. Who's this, Magnus? Alright, I'm not going to bother chasing down the ones that are running away, I just don't care that much. There we go. I just want them to leave me alone, in all honesty. If they run away, I'm happy with that. Like, the goblin bows are just terrible. So even if we kill these guys, we're not really getting anything out of it. Okay, well, our archers can't do anything, so we're just going to wait there, I guess. Yeah, none of them can do anything, because the goblins are all behind objects. Alright, well. Uh, yeah, I guess my best bet is just move you over here. Everybody's super fatigued now. Okay, he's running. Not that he's got anywhere to run to. Oh my god, Einar finally broke out of the net. Oh my god. 
It only took him the entire battle. He did it, though. All right. Uh, Gundrum, you may as well just hang out there. Honestly, I don't think this battle's going to go on much longer. I imagine the last two Ambushers are just going to run away. Yeah, they're leaving. Okay, that's fine. Saved me a lot of trouble. All right, we just got to put this one out of his misery. There we go. Okay, now we can just end the rest of our turns. And that should hopefully be the end of it. I swear, if I get attacked again, I'm going to be super annoyed. We are so... Hey, Fritz slipped. We are so freaking close to that town. I just want to get there and get paid. Um, all right, we got a Goblin Skewer. We got uh, Notch Blades and no Falchions, unfortunately. Boondock Bow. All right. Yeah, we didn't get anything really that great. Goblin Skewer is not bad. It's lightweight, at least, but it's not fantastic either. All right, off we go. We should probably sell some of the stuff we're carrying. We're carrying a lot of stuff that we're not going to use. There we go. We got our 330 crowns for that. That was ridiculous. Okay. Um, we need a lot of stuff. Fortunately, we have a decent amount of gold sitting around. And we've also got some stuff to sell. Oh, we've got a dog. We should equip that. Give that to somebody. Uh, also, everybody leveled up. Or most three people leveled up. Oh, that's actually kind of disappointing. Alright, Boulder. You are actually quite good at ranged combat. Uh, do I have anyone that I might want to replace? Hmm. He's also quite good at melee combat, though. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Why does Balder have a spear? He's really good at melee. Whatever. Uh, let's see. Is there anyone in the back line who I would like in the front line instead? Not really. Yeah, I think we'll just stick Balder in the, in the front line. Um... So, what can I get you? Well, we'll bump your initiative up, and we will bump up your resolve, definitely. And I guess your range skill, and actually we can give you those uh, bolas, but for now, we give you dodge as well. Um, so where do those bolas go? Oh, we got a bunch of these. Cool. Uh, I'm going to hand you a couple of those. There you go. You can throw up people. Uh, Einar, you are... Really not good at melee combat, but you do have quite good initiative, so you get dodge as well. Where is the talent that lets you... This one. This is the one that I want to give to people who are bad at fighting. Taunt. Okay, so we'll look at taking that on some of our uh, tankier people later. Alright, we'll get you that, we'll get you that, and I guess we'll just give you some more HP. And that should do. And who else leveled up? Erwin! Crossman, first level, you get nine lives. You get plus to that, plus range defense, and I guess plus initiative. All right, that's pretty good. Okay, so let's take a look at some of this equipment we got. Uh, notch blades, our sword dagger, one-handed. How good are they compared to like short swords that we're carrying? 30 to 40, 20 to 30. They're worse in like every way, except they're slightly lighter weight. Um, what abilities do they have? Do they have armor piercing? Oh, hang on, I need to actually... Yeah, they do. Okay, so those are actually probably not a bad idea to give to our archers as backup weapons, just for the armor piercing. And for the fact that they're lighter weight. So let's hand a few of those out. There we go. Uh, Goblin Skewer is, like, worse than the spears we're currently carrying in every way, apart from being, uh, less than half the weight. Which is actually not bad if we're just using them to spear wall. Hmm, 25 to 35, 30 to 35. Yeah. Huh. Actually, not not a terrible idea. I might just give one of these to Fritz for the moment, just because his fatigue is awful right now. I guess it doesn't really matter, actually. Two fatigue is not going to help him all that much. Um, And we also have this full leather cap, which I guess we can give to one of the archers. Here, Herbert. Actually, Herbert's only been here for two days. He's taken part in four battles. You've had four battles in the last two days. Jesus. Um, Gisela, you can have a proper hat. And then Guntram. Actually, Egon. Oh, you already have a proper hat. Okay. There you go. Guntram have a proper hat. Herbert can have a hood. Alright. Um, now, we should definitely sell some of this stuff and also recruit you guys. And also, the dog should go with somebody. Hmm, but who? 
How about Magnus? Magnus can have a dog. Okay, that replaces bandages, but that's fine. So Magnus has really good melee defense anyways. Magnus just has really good defense in general. 29, 26. Pretty decent. Okay. Now. Oh, right. We were going to sell a bunch of stuff. Um, Goblin Skewer we can get rid of. And the Boondock Bow. Which I'm pretty sure is just worse than the bows we've currently got. Yeah. Worst range. It's just lighter. That's all it's got. Um, skirmisher shields. Actually, not bad. Less defense, but they're like half the weight. They're basically better versions of the buckler. Speaking of, we should sell all these bucklers we're carrying. I'm not going to use those. Uh, cleavers, these. Reinforced flail, yeah. I'll hang on to all of those. Get rid of that. We have a lot of spears. We have a ton of spears. Okay, let's get rid of some of these. I don't think we need all of them. Get rid of all the damaged ones. Alright, we got a falchion we could give to someone as well. Get rid of that. Uh, get rid of knives. We've got daggers. We have so many daggers. Jeez, we have so much stuff. Where did all this come from? Just drag all this up so I'm not constantly having to scroll all the way to the bottom. Okay. Uh, what else? Get rid of those. Ancient shield is fine. Get rid of these knives. Jesus, man. A little bit overboard with the equipment here. Put a knife. Okay, that should do. Uh, and we could actually pick up some... We have a lot of money on hand right now, which I'm happy about because this is actually a good place to have it. Oh, wow. Okay, their stuff is actually quite expensive because um, they've got all these negative effects. Well, supply... Well, not well supply, but disappearing villagers and ambush trade routes as a big negative, uh, which is a shame, because we actually really need tools right now. And... Ah, hello. Brawler. We could spend all of our money to hire a level 2 wild man. Or a level 3. Huh. No. We'll hire the brawler. Because we need another frontline guy. Uh, ooh, loyal. And survivor. Fantastic. Okay, you are reasonable at melee. Not quite as good as some of our other hires, but that's okay. Because I'm going to give you a spear. And Baldur is going to have a falchion, and he can put down his short sword. And he's going to be on the flank. Um, I'm actually going to give Baldur a wooden skirmisher shield. There we go. Alright, so Vander, you get this, you get a full leather cap, you get a spear, and a shield, and a short sword. Actually, you get a hand out. Uh, I'll give you a hatchet for now, because you're... Not super survivy yet. Okay, does somebody else need backup equipment that I'm forgetting about? No, you guys are pretty well set up. Alright. Uh, oh, we should buy ammo as well. Alright, so we need ammo and tools, um, and having some armor would be nice, and we kind of have to buy them here unless we just want to move on and just abandon this town. Let's see what their contracts are. If their contracts are bad, we'll just pass on. Uh, there's monsters. Let's talk pay. Six trans advance, another 220 when the job is done. More when it's done. Yeah, it's not great pay for hunting down monsters. It's only one skull, though. I was looking for something nice and simple we could take on. Uh, this guy wants us to track down some brigands. Yeah, see, if we want to do either of these, we really need to fix up our armor and peel and stuff like that. We might just leave this town. Driver brings off Fort Red. Yeah. Um, is there another nearby town that has, like, an armor or things of that nature? We're actually sort of okay on medical supplies, which is kind of impressive. Uh, Haystead has an armor. Cool. Let's just head back to Haystead. All right. Ah, Haystead also has a contract. Uh, Haystead has... At least something that's on ambush trade routes. God damn it. Okay, well... They'll give us a better price for tools, which is good. And they also have less tools on offer, which is a shame. Alright, well, we'll buy the tools, because we need them. And we will buy... Now nah, we'll hang out with the rest of our money. I think it's not really anything here worth buying. Oh, ammo. We need ammo. Right. We'll pick up that. Okay. Uh, well, we now need money. So what do you got for me? I mean, tiff some local brigands. They're willing to pay us a decent amount. Man, nobody wants to negotiate. All right, so I will accept that, but I think that might actually have to wait for 
another day. Because I'm all out of time. I mean, we'll take the contract. But uh, that is what I'm going to call it for today. So, thank you all so much for watching. And I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.